Rembrandt lighting is similar to closed loop lighting, but as mentioned previous, this shadow now joins the shadow on the cheek and you get that nice triangle light. That is the light, that is the essence of Rembrandt lighting. And that is because when Rembrandt used to paint his portraits, all his portraits had that highlight triangle on the far cheek. Again, the main light is about 45 degree off, but slightly further back, primarily because she has such a small nose, we have to overemphasize it and bring it further around just to create that meeting shadow. This is a favorite of many editorial photographers. This is the go-to, probably aside from maybe Paramount, which we'll go into at a later date. I think it's fair to say I'm not a huge fan of Rembrandt lighting. I struggle to find many examples in my own work but you can use it as a transition shadow from loop lighting, or you can use it with a fill light just to soften the blow.